I think we're pretty good. I. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to some more Mario Party 5 minigame playthroughs. We're going to be doing two versus two today. Toad, me, and Boo versus the rivals, Wario and Mario. Can they coexist in this video? Let's find out. First up, we got Clock Stoppers, so let's do that. We're gonna go in order, even though it's not alphabetical order, it's alternating back and forth. Okay, push the hands of the clock to match the clock in the middle. The first team to do this three times wins, or the most times. Move and jump. Move one hand over the, of the clock while your teammate moves the other. So, I try to move the minute hand, and then the partner moves the hour hand. Okay. And with the player controlling, we can... We... My god. Oh my... Okay. I thought I wasn't gonna get that one. Oh my god. I try to jump over the hour hand, but it doesn't work. I have to go around it. M Boo! What are you doing? Fine, I'll move the... Oh my god, Boo. Stupid. Stupid. I tried to do this little recording a little bit ago, and Boo, Boo was actually more competent, meaning he actually did work in that minigame, but no, this time he decided to screw me over. What? You're off my team. Go away. Ha! All right. Diffuse or lose? Dang it. All right. I'm not going to retry the minigames. We're going to see which team is number one, so... No retries, one try each per minigame, so we'll see how it goes. Slow the burning fuse by doing a ground pound directly on it. If you if a spark reaches King Bob Bomb, you will lose. Wow, oh no. Move and jump and ground pound. Look where the fuses cross each other to slowly to to slow two sparks with a single ground pound. That can be a little Tongue twisty to read, but alright. We get the gist of it. Okay. Toad has a tiny ass, so. I'm not gonna cover a big margin, so. Alright, come on, boo. You got that. To Toad, will you actually do the butt stomping for once? Boo is actually working on two of them, which is pretty good. In the meantime, I'm just doing one so far. Come on! Oh, I still got them both. He's working on the middle one, I'm going back and forth. Oh, never mind. Oh, get that one. Come on, we're so close. We're so close. Oh wow, I got both of them. Oh, oh. Oh, what? Uh, the score is tied, one all. One per team, all right. That was a close one. We lost last time, but this time we actually did it, even though we were pretty close that time. Okay, ID UFO. Find the panels that match the two UFOs. You and your teammate must then do a ground pound at, on both panels at the same time. whoop de doo To get a point, you have to do a ground pound on your panel at the same time your teammate does a ground pound on his or hers. If you ground pound on the wrong panel, that panel will flash red, indicating that you suck. Alright. 
Come on, boo. We can actually do this. Some of the UFOs can be a little confusing, but... Yeah, like this one. Okay. Oh, you sack of... Okay, I got it. Oh. No. I was actually... What? Okay, this is not good. Oh, come on, really? See? That's what I mean. Some of the UFOs can be a little confusing. Especially because a few of them have similar designs. So, yeah. Oh, well. Two for them, one for us. If we win this one, then I'm gonna notice a pattern. Can you notice the pattern? Because I certainly can. Open the can, Mario can can, using the seesaw can opener. Alternate jumps on the seesaw to open the can. And ground pound? A ground pound will make the can opener move faster. Well, obviously. <laughs> okay. Come on, boo boo. Come on! Come on, boo! I don't think we're gonna... ...do this. Although, whoop! Okay, we just barely won that. Barely. Wow. Boo! You gotta keep up the rhythm there. I was keeping up the rhythm, but you weren't, okay? Okay. Okay, so, so far, two all. They won these two, we won these two. I don't know if it'll be like the same for the rest of them, but we'll see. Alright, next up we have Handy Hoppers. Okay. A jumping rope type of minigame. Jump over the bar as many times as you can. One player rotates the lever to turn the bar, or lever, depending on which you pronounce it, and the other player jumps. Alright, and L and R alternating will turn the bar. Tap A for a smaller jump, obviously. And press L and R rapidly to increase the speed of the bar, but be careful not to force your partner to make a mistake. Otherwise, you will cost your team the victory. Okay. Ooh, I'm jumping. Woo. Hey! Oh! Ah! Whoop! Oh! 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 oh. Ow! I did not. Whoop, whoop. Oh. Come on, boo. Oh, come. Okay, I you probably can't see that, but uh, I'm doing the... Yeah. But yeah, we actually beat the record this time, which is actually pretty good. I was on 36 for quite a while, so there we go. If I didn't mess up that one time, we probably could have gotten 40. So, there you go. Alright, Billy Basket. Alright, so far, three for my team, two for them. Okay. Are you keeping the score? Probably not, but yeah. Ha! Work with your partner to get as many fruits as possible. The team with the most points is the winner. Player catching fruit, hopefully moi. And the player shooting the ball to drop the berries is move closer and throw the ball. If the falling fruit touches the ground, it will vanish. Be sure to catch it before it falls. And catch a black fruit and will freeze temporarily. Wow. Who knew black fruit was so terrifying? Ow, ow! Stop. 
Come on, boo! Oh, boo, 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 boo! Yeah! Oh! Oh! Ah! Come on, we could have had that. Boo! If you had, if you, if you had actually gotten the fucking golden berry, we could have tied them or beat them by one. But no, it's your fault. All right, I know the, I know the ball dropped early. I know, but still, it's your fault. <laughs> if I was the one catching the fish, I wouldn't have missed anything. So. Oh, tied three all. Damn. <sighs> so sad. All right, bus buffer. Polish the roof of the bus completely. The team that clears its bus first wins. Move the buffer around. The buffer is hard to control, so focus on controlling it. Yes, sir. Okay. This is a pretty easy minigame, so. Even with hard computer players, this is pretty easy. Although, not when you do that. Alright. Come on. Come on, boo-boo. We got this. Oh yeah, we got it. I think so, anyway. Yeah, we, do. we did. Okay. Finish. They missed a couple of spots. They missed three spots. There was one there, there was one there, and one there. Oh wow, they suck. They don't, they need to work on their attention to detail. Rumble ready. Woo! Alright. This is a rumbling minigame. If you don't have the rumble, it will show the exclamation mark above the head. So, there you go. Be the first player to react to the rumble and catch the capsule. Catch, catch three capsules first or end with the most capsules to win. Catch and press A the instant you feel the rumble. If you press it early, the capsule goes to the other team. Why? Because, well, they suck. If you turned off the rumble feature, then an exclamation point will appear. But we got awesome rumble. So, there we go. Okay, boof. Get the first one. Otherwise, I'm going to kick you off. Ah, I'll take that. I don't think you can actually hear the rumble, but I'll do this on my next turn. Oh, good job, boo. Damn, you got the second one in a row. Wow, nice. Okay. Ooh. Didn't mean to push the mic, but there you go. Hopefully you heard that. All right. Five, two, four, right? We did eight mini games already, so that's five to three. Is it? Or is it four all? I think it's four all. Okay. All right, sub marathon. Now this one is actually interesting because it's a button massing time kind of thing, but kind of not as well. Race your submarine to the finish line. One character uses the lever while the other one rests. Whoever finishes first wins. You press simultaneously to operate the submarine and then while they switch places. Resting player can blink the submarine eyes and lips and move the lips by pressing A. More of a visual kind of thing. Switching is the key. When the character gets tired, switch places with the other character. I usually go for most of it in uh, in the game, so. Alright, Boo is gonna go first, but I'll mood it when I do the button master.
Okay, I didn't go all the way that time, but I think we'll put it good. I Apparently, even when Boo is doing the you-know-what, if you press Y, you'll switch places. I was going to do this, but I pressed the controller against myself and pressed the Y button by mistake. Dang it! That should not count, but... Ah. <sighs> uh... It is kind of my own fault, but I didn't know that pressing Y, even when he's doing it, will do that, so. This one is a little bit tough to win, so I'm gonna have to really button press on this one. Manic Malice. Hit the switch with the hammer. The team that hits it the most times wins. Tapping A repeatedly, repeatedly swing hammer. And the giant hammer in the background will point to the team that has the lower number of hits. All right. Start. Finish. I can't I can't go fast at all. I've gotten into the 190 before, but I just don't have the speed. I tense up, and that doesn't allow me to actually get a fast motion, so. Hmm. That was 10 minigames. They got 6, and my team got 4. And since this is a bonus minigame, I guess we'll go with whoever has the most coins will win that minigame. But if we tie, then... So, actually... We're tied. I did a recount of the, the games that I my team won and they won. So we're actually five all. So actually I'm still able to win this. Let's go to Panic Pinball. Control your pinball flippers with your teammate and try to get the most points. The team with the most points wins. Activate flipper with A and try to get the Bowser counter down to zero. If the team does this, several balls will be in play for that team. If you hit a Goomba with the ball, the wheels will start turning. If you line up the pictures, you can score really big points. Alright, this is 50-50. Sometimes I would have good luck, other times no. So... How dare you! Oh my god! Oh, there we go. Oh, yes! Oh yeah, there we go. We got a lot of balls. <laughs> oh, come on! That was supposed to be mine. What? That's not fair. Oh yeah, we are in the lead, but still. Oh my god! What? Come on! Come on! How dare you? Okay, we actually won. Good. Okay. Well, I didn't think we would win that one on the first try, but holy hell, we got it. So yeah, that was pretty cool. Now it's six to five for my team. So I think we're good. So even if they win this one, yeah, we will get into a tie and then we'll go back to some marathon. But my team usually wins with more coins in this one, so 
We'll see. Bank and coins. One player hits the base to get coins, while the other player collects them. Move and jump. The floor tilts depending on where both players are standing, plan your movements to keep the floor from tilting too much, otherwise the coin will go bye bye. Aw, oh, there goes the bridge. Now we're trapped. Stop. How uncool. Come on! Oh! Ho oh, oh, ho oh, oh, ho oh. Boo! Will you actually do something? Get the coin, you stinking boo boo! Can we get the 30? We got. Can we get the 30? Can we get the. Oh ho 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 ho! We could have actually gotten more if Boo had actually done something. He collected a few coins, uh, but I collected the most. I got both the money bags too, and I got the last coin to get 30. And we beat them by a landslide because they got 16, so... Alright, my team is the winner. 8 to... 7 to 5. I was about to say 8 to 6, but that's 14 minigames. No, that's 12. So 7 to 5, my team is the victor. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh yeah! <laughs> so. Alright, so that's all the minigames for 2 vs 2. I don't know why it didn't... But... I usually win the minigame anyway because I usually just go most of the way, but... I don't know, that one time that I didn't remember that pressing Y, even when they are doing it, will actually switch, so. My fault, so. Okay, so yeah. Comment down below, what is your favorite 2 vs 2 minigame? What is your least favorite 2 vs 2 minigame? And I will see you next time for when we go to 1 vs 3. And then we'll do 4 player. And then we'll do story. Sounds good? Alright. Later.